In this video, I'll show you how to use large texts with RTL Fixer. If I'll disable and enable this option, I can pick how many characters after which a line would break. Let's say I wanted a lot of words or characters, basically, in every line. I could write something like 100, 200, which again will be the number of characters that are in each line until a line is broken. I should note that the lines are breaking without breaking any words. This means that the app can understand when a new word is starting, so it will only break a line where there is spaces and not in the middle of words. Let's see this in action. Let's try 20 characters per row. Let's copy and paste this text right here. As you can see, there are only about 20 characters per row in the pasted text. Now let's try 60 characters. I'm copying the text, pasting it, and as you can see, we have about 60 characters per row. Now let's assume that you want to create a new row in the middle of a sentence. So what you will need to do is use this key command, which now you have with RTL Fixer. You will use Control, Shift, and Left Arrow. This is an automation that will only work when RTL Fixer is enabled. Let's do this again, just for the sake of it. We put the cursor where I want to break the new line, and I use the short key command. And as you can see, this has created a new line. Let's say you wanted to reconnect one of the lines to the line that is above it. I will put the cursor at the end of the sentence, and now I will do the same only with right arrow key. So, Control, Shift, and right arrow key. Again, this is an automation that enables you to do this. So remember, RTL Fixer must be enabled for this to work. Let's try this again. Again, I am putting the cursor in the end of the line and press Control Shift and right arrow key. And this is how it works. Enjoy!